uh, the first of a series on um, being a series on ER, uh, the movie or the TV show ER uh, builds and cars from them. So the first one I'm going to start out on the series with is Susan Lewis's 1970 Buick. Well, I can talk today. 1970 Volkswagen Beetle, I guess. This car. There it is. And so it's Susan Lewis's 1970 Volkswagen Beetle um, from ER. Okay. So, the way we want to do this build, first start things off, is to get this car, you want to go from your phone to the internet, find Southern San Andreas Autos, this is a two-door vehicle, and then you guys scroll down, until you see the BF Weevil right here, this is the one you guys want, currently it's 652 at the moment. Uh, Susan's is blue, that's not the right color of blue, but we'll go ahead and make it blue for now. Alright, so hit buy. And then if you have enough money, what it's going to do next is it's on the top of your screen. It's going to drop down a drop down menu. And it's going to say which garage would you like to stick it in. Alright, using your left down right up pad, you're going to go from the, t using your left down right up pads. You're going to go down, using the down, 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 until you find the garage you want. Once you highlight it over that garage, it acts on your controller, and that'll complete the purchase. All right. So, we're not going to complete the purchase right now because I already have one, as you can see. So what we're going to do next is we're going, once we're outside here, we're going to call our mechanic. And once, okay, so once you guys complete your purchase, wait about five, ten minutes, right? And then once you're, um, once you get a little message that pops up above your map on the lower left hand side of your screen, it's going to say that your car has been delivered to whatever garage you're stuck in during your purchase process. Once that happens, and that little message pops up, you're going to call your mechanic and have them deliver to you, okay? Uh, currently, mine is in my auto shop, okay? Uh, so, auto shop, and we're looking for the Weevil right here. It is right here, guys that weevil in order to have them deliver it on uh, I would use the left down right up pads and I would just use the down or the up okay once I'm down on top of once I'm on top of it hit X on the controller and he'll deliver it to you alright and I am already have it right here so I don't need them to deliver it but that's how you would do it alright once you're in the car you're gonna take this down get a local listing with this customs for customization purposes Okay. Okay. Alright, you see where that little message just popped up, guys, on the lower left hand side of my screen? Um, that over there is kind of where it pops up for your indication for your vehicle being delivered. Alright. Alright, so let's pull in here and get started with the build. Here for the magic touch. Yeah, it's just telling me that the vehicle can be modified at Benny's. Uh, yeah, but we don't need more. This isn't a Benny's built up. So, anyway, all right, guys. First thing you want to do when you pull it in here is you want to go armor all the way up to 100% armor. Okay, you want to go all the way up to 100% armor in this build. And then in brakes, you want to go all the way to race brakes. Okay. The bumper, you're going to leave this stock. You're going to leave the rear stock. And then for your engine, you're going to go all the way down to level 4 EMS upgrade. And um, then for you're going to leave it stock exhaust, no explosives, fender, you're going to leave in those stock hood, you're leaving that stock, no hood accessories, okay, uh, horn, your guys' choice, lights, stock headlights, no neons, no livery on this one, okay, so this doesn't have a livery on it at all. So, no livery. So, let's just leave it at none. And then, loss prevention, you only need to do this if you steal a vehicle. If you steal one of these, 
Um, that's the only reason you would have to do loss prevention. Plate. All right, so now on this part, um, this is, again, I, I customized the plate using the Rockstar Games page. Um, from my phone, I went to the rockstargames.com page. Uh, from the main page, on, um, from my phone, on the main page at the very top of the page, you're going to see at the very top of that page on your phone it's going to be like three lines you're going to click on those three lines when you do that a little drop down menu is going to drop down you're going to find that on that drop down menu all the way you're going to find games click on games that'll take you to the game page once you're on there you're going to look for there's a bunch of pictures as you're scrolling down there's a bunch of pictures of actual video game covers uh you're going to find the one that says gta online click on cl actually click on the image and it'll take you to the GTA Online page. You scroll all the way to the bottom of that page, and at the very bottom, it'll say "Getting Started with the Plates" with a picture of the plates, and say "Getting Started." Click "Getting Started," and you'll be able to go into your plates. Um, make it say B7N438. That's what plate she had on in the show. So that's what the plate is now. For your primary color, this is going to be a metallic, and then. going to be a metallic yes it's going to be it's like a real light blue that's even not bad right there guys Turner blue, trying that, and then the secondary metallic Mariner blue. That looks pretty good, guys. All right, and then trim color inside her car was black. All right, and then no roll cage. No, no. You can have anything on the roof. And then stock skirts. No no spoiler suspension stock. Transmission come all the way down to race transmission. And then turbo come all the way down to turbo. And then now for your wheels. Okay, so Susan's wheels were like Yeah, that's the closest. All right, so those, and then okay, so fair lines on if you want, and then back out wheel color, blue alloy, and then tire tire design. You don't want any writing on them, I don't think. So just leave. She didn't have any writing on her tire, I don't think. So let me just double check real quick from the stock image. Nope, she didn't have any writing on her tire. So leave this at stock tire. Tire enhancements, make sure you add your bulletproof tires right here. And then tire smoke, make sure you go to black tire smoke. Okay, and then you want to back out. And that finishes the build. All right, guys. It's, of course, dark out, so you can't see it. Um, let me roll this back. Hello, whoever's watching. Let me roll this all the way back to my auto shop. You guys can see it okay. Hello, whoever's watching, leave me a message. I'll know you there. I appreciate you checking out my video.
Alright guys, this is uh, the finished Beetle for Susan Lewis's 1970 Volkswagen Beetle from the TV show ER. Okay, uh, this was driven by Susan Lewis. Again, it's a 1970 Volkswagen Beetle. Okay, and you again can get it from the phone here and then you go into Southern San Andreas Autos and then this is a two-door vehicle so the two-door cab tab at the top scroll down so you see the Beetle right here in the green one that's the wrong one hold on one second now scroll down do you see the Beetle there. that's one you guys want Okay, and then hit buy. That's how you get the car. And once you get the car, go outside, or if you're not already outside, once you're outside, or buy the car from there. And then uh, once you're outside, you can go down to, or you can have your mechanic deliver it to you. And then um, once your purchase is done, and the little message pops up above your map, it'll say that it's been delivered. Once that happens, um, if you're not already outside, go outside and then have your mechanic deliver the car to you. Take it over call your mechanic from your phone have them deliver your car and then take it down to local Los Santos customs for customization purposes alright guys if you follow this video you should be able to build Susan Lewis's 1970 Volkswagen Beetle from the show ER and remember guys if you want the actual plate it's right here B7N438 uh, the way you get this guys is follow my video I showed you get in the video I talked about how to do it but one more time real quick it's go to the Rockstar Games page uh, from your phone go to the Rockstar Games page once you're on that uh, at the very top of the home page there's like three lines click on the three lines that'll drop down the drop down menu and once you're on that click games once you're on the games page you're gonna see uh, images of actual game coverage you're gonna scroll down to if you don't find the one that says GTA online click it on the actual image and it'll take you to the GTA online page scroll all the way to the very bottom of the page close to it you'll see uh, a picture of the plates and it says getting started click it's getting started and it'll let you go into the plates um, it lets you make up to 30 plates if you don't already have 30 it'll let you make one once you do that you're gonna make it say B7N 438 and that's how you do the plate guys and then uh yeah i hope you guys um like to comment and subscribe all right um i like uh if you guys are new to my channel please subscribe also um if you're a fan of tv and movie card builds you come to the right place because that's really all i build with the exception of a few other things but mostly it's tv and movie cars all right guys i appreciate you guys liking commenting and subscribing make sure you go check out all my back builds on my playlist, I have over like 200 videos, guys. Something like that. So there's a lot to check out over there. Um, I'm also, also almost always updating on adding new stuff. So please subscribe to make sure you're getting all my um, new stuff. And also, you can see when I'm live. All right. I appreciate you guys liking, commenting, and subscribing. Thanks for checking out my video. And we'll see you guys on a future video. Bye, everybody.